Hey people, so I've been messing around with some expanding drill heads. Uh, my design rule was that the expanding parts have to fit within the size of the original drill head, so you can't have stuff poking out really. And uh, yeah, I've come up with three designs of varying sizes, so uh, let's take a look. First off, we have the original drill head down there on the bottom, and then we have some rotors with some pistons on them, so basically these fold in and lie on top of the original drill heads. This increases the height of the drill head by two blocks plus a rotor we have to rotate for this to work. And uh, yeah, doing the math, I've only done the math based on the size of the drill, so not the amount they drill outside the actual volume. So as you can see in the hole here, it sticks a bit out, it drills a bit more than its actual volume, but I haven't taken that into account, so amount drills will be better than this. But with this setup, we get the 3.2 times more ore mined, uh, or 3.2 times greater volume, assuming that the seam is two blocks high. So yeah, that is quite a lot. I mean, we had four more drills, so that's less than 50% more drills, but we get 3.2, so 420% uh, of our ore. So yeah, that's pretty neat. Uh, this scales, so... If we go bigger, we get a lot more out of our drills, but of course we get a bigger drilling head. So scaling it up one block uh, on each side, so instead of 3x3 three three, we are 5x5. Five five. This time in a cross it's a bit less efficient because our radius goes out here instead of the diagonal. But uh, yeah, um, big hole and uh, doing the same math on this one, we end up with 5.2 times more uh, ore mined. So uh, yeah, it scales. And not only do we, of course, get bigger when we drill bigger, but we get a bigger gain as well. Uh, I've messed around with pistons, and I only got it to work on something that is seven by seven. So this was just too small to make it work with pistons, unless I were drilling head really, really tall, and I didn't want to do that. So let's go over here. Um, uh, as you can see. Um, pretty big hole. Same deal, uh, the whole thing folds in on top of the drilling head, this time 7x7, seven seven. and uh, doing the math we get 15 times more ore than we would have gotten with just the drilling head, again assuming the seam is two blocks high. Uh, I actually drilled this hole with a three block high drilling head, but I reduced it, uh, I did the math on two uh, because I want it to be consistent with the rest and I think the seams are usually two blocks high, that's five meters uh, but it may be more so yeah and if we scale this up further so increase the drilling head perhaps a bit or add a more pistons we could double or triple that uh, g gain uh, but of course you have uh, the downside in time because sure we are mining 15 times more ore but that means we are mining 14 times the amount of ore this head is drilling with only the four drills out here. Uh, so it's going to take a lot longer. But uh, if it's just a fire and forget kind of deal, if it's a drilling uh, thing you are setting up and um, just setting to mine and then leaving, well, you'll gain a lot more ore per drill head this time, this uh, this way, plus driving around with a drill head this size, uh, if it weren't using the system, if it were just to build drills all the way out, would be absolutely massive. So packing the drill head up, I'm just gonna, I haven't done any programming on this, which you would kind of have to, because when you double the radius of a circle, you're doubling the circumference as well. So you're doubling the speed, the surface speed of the drill heads. And uh, obviously the drills are not gonna drill faster just because you're moving them faster. So um, yeah, it's gonna take a lot longer. And uh, you may have to use some programming to slow down drill head as the drills uh, go out. Otherwise you're gonna end up uh, with stuck drills or just not mining very efficiently. So let's just pop these back in swiftly and get this back up is that retracting? that's not retracting, why is it not retracting? Um, did I do the wrong pistons? no I did not that's weird 
Oh yeah, it's uh, <laughs> they are they are filled with quite a bit of ore, I assume. Yeah. So yeah, as you can see, it takes up quite little of the actual volume of this whole drill, and even in this case, I think we could loop around with the. Okay, that's annoying. So even in this case, I think we could loop around. So go up with a. Uh, conveyor back down and out one block ahead and add another piston so we could probably get another 10 meter so that's an, yes another 10 meters on our radius which would be see how much is that that is one third so 1.3 and we gotta square that yeah almost uh, twice as much volume we would get by adding another piston uh, at least 50 percent more so uh, definitely has some possibilities, but then again, I'm not even sure how big seams are. Are they this big? I kind of doubt it. So there are diminishing returns, of course, uh, both in regard to speed and should it be done? I mean, does it make sense? Uh, are there even that big seams? Uh, personally, I think in my survival game, I'm going to go with something like this um, or maybe something like this just starts getting a bit big, you know? And uh, I need at least two large car containers for this one. I think I'm gonna go with this because three times more will uh, almost fill up a car container and I usually wanna drill more than one type of ore when I'm out drilling. So I think I'm just gonna do this. I can do that on my existing rig. Guess I'll have to expand a bit. So yeah, uh, this is my experimental world. So I've also got, um, well, the experiment for my space elevator here and I've done a few designs uh, I think this is the third one actually I built another one that kind of exploded but this is uh, what I'm going with I'm not going to go too much in depth I'm just going to give a quick demonstration so we press the button and we move up at 90 meters per second so yeah it uh, it works pretty well uh, I gotta fix the acceleration because if we start going down here that's just gonna disappear <laughs> Uh, so yeah, it uh, it stops on a dime and it zooms back down and it's gonna smash into uh, the button there. Oh yeah. So uh, yeah, I think that is all I've got for this time around. So I hope this was uh, informative at least. And uh, yeah, see ya.